everybody, Monte here, and welcome back to another tutorial episode of Fallen A2P. This episode we're going to talk about the world map and travel within it, going to different cities, missions, things like that. So first thing, you've finished your first mission, you're at the Purgatory Monastery, you can either head up over to the exclamation point to do the next mission, something else you can do. We're going to run over to... Dramin, try to avoid these cars. All I do is left click to move and then you can right click to scroll around with the mouse. These cars that you're seeing kind of fade in and out, these are enemies. If you run into them, you will have to go into a battle just like that first mission. That's one way to collect good resources or you might need to actually avoid them if you're hurting, so just be aware of that. Notice over these cities that I've just gone over, there are four icons. A little money symbol, which is for trade available. This fuel tank icon here is for recharging. You have the little person icon here, which means you can recruit, and a little comment bubble icon, which means there's rumors available. Rumors are also going to give you other points of interest on the map. So let's go ahead and jump in here. You click on the site on the bottom of the map, and here we have it. Like I said, you got trade, you got rumors, you got recruit, and you have recharge. Let's just take a look at each one, and next episode we're going to be talking more about your skills and your caravan. So first thing you can do here, of course, trade. So you have your actual caravan inventory, along with any characters you have available. The little triangle pyramid you see here means that they have a skill up available. Again, we'll talk about that next episode. On the bottom left, you have your total funds. Along with anything on the right is items that you can buy from this trade shop, and it'll show you things that you've sold, which you can just click over here. Boom, you get money, so you just left click it, drag it over here, make some money. I always suggest when you open up your inventory, you can move everything into the caravan, and then it's really easy to just go ahead and throw everything over here to sell. So you're gonna want these funds, because the next thing you're gonna wanna do is go to your rumors. And this is where you have to spend scrap to listen to these rumors. So let's go ahead and do that. There was a muta caravan carrying some books to the National Library, but they were ambushed somewhere near this location. So we're going to have to go there, use our nutcracker, and break in. Okay, here's our recruitment tab. We have a human available, we have a muta, and then we also have another human. Notice though, we have a caravan cap 4 of 4. We will be able to upgrade this in our caravan, but we'll talk about that more next episode. So right now, we're going to leave this alone and not recruit anybody, seeing as how we already have 4 of 4. But if you did lose anybody in the first mission, definitely feel free to swing by and give somebody a good old recruit. Now you're recharged, this is your A2P. This is your fuel. So right now our current max is 1,000 and we can recharge all the way for 462. Let's go ahead and do a full recharge and that will unlock a energy thirsty achievement. Well done, well done. Alright guys, this is the map. Good luck in your travels. As you can see, here is the new location to go for the Nutcracker, but we'll talk more about our caravan and our skills next episode. See you then. Again, thanks for playing.